Welcome Smackers, Kevin Smack here with another Fortnite Fix video. Basically, this one is the last step to do. Let me repeat that. The last steps to do. If you have not already tried everything else you could find, please try that first. If you're having audio issues, I'll link some stuff up here so you can go and check that out. I have a lot of simple audio videos that fix it. This is a video that will really fix things, say um, everything's working in Windows, uh, you're able to work on like Skype and Discord, but then you go into Fortnite and it's just not working. So these are uh, what's going to go through here. So I'm going to go through and show you these things here and we're going to get this resolved for you. We can get you back in game, talking trash to your friends and having fun. <laughs> so let's do this. Uh, guys, if this is your first time here, do me a favor. If you like tech fixes, you know, tutorials and gaming, do me a favor and subscribe and click that bell notification. Uh, so let's go ahead and just jump right into this, guys. We're gonna... The first thing's the easiest thing to do. After you've done all the other fixes, what you do, you go in your Fortnite launcher, you click this little uh, gear here, and you choose Verify. Let's go ahead and choose Verify. And what it's going to do is it's going to go through and check everything to make sure it is correct in your system. So it's going to go through and look all your files and make sure they're right. If they're not right, it's going to fix them. This is the first step to do. This is the easiest out of the three. So this can go through and take care of this. So after you've done that, you want to try everything. I would reboot the computer first. Uh, try everything. See if it's working for you. If not, then we move on to the second step. While that's verifying, what we'll do is we'll get ready for the next step. So what that entails is something called CC Cleaner uh, or C Cleaner, whatever you want to call it. Uh, basically, uh, just go ahead and go ahead and put CC Cleaner in Google. It'll bring you to the site so you can go ahead and download it. Uh, go ahead and choose Download CC Cleaner. It is a free program. It's a great program. It keeps your computer running nice and smooth. So you want to look for the free area right here. Roll down and choose download. It'll go through and download. It'll ask for names. Uh, let's not do that. Let's just download. We'll go to uh, desktop and save. And now put that on the desktop for you. Once it's done, all you do is double click it. It's a quick next, next, next install kind of program. It'll probably ask you where you want it. Uh, you can tell it where you want it as well. So what we want to do is go into CC Cleaner. Now that it's installed, let's double click on it. Go ahead and say yes to this if it comes up. And we're going to go to the tools section. And we're going to let the programs fill in. We're going to go to Epic Game Launcher. And then we're just going to take a moment and I'm just going to tell you a few things here real quick. First of all, before you uninstall Fortnite, make sure you go in, take a picture of your sensitivity. Take a picture of your settings all together your key bindings, anything that you've changed that you want to keep, you want to go ahead and take a picture or write down those things so you don't miss it. Very important because installing with CC Cleaner, C Cleaner, sorry, will remove everything. So you want to make sure that you do that first. Afterwards, what you would do is choose uninstall. It would remove it. Once it's completely removed, reboot the computer and then you want to install the game again. I'll put another link up here on how to install Fortnite if you don't remember. Um, and you can go ahead and just run through that and then you're all installed. Once you're installed, your issue should be fixed if it was Fortnite related because it is a brand new, fresh Fortnite install and C Cleaner removed everything from it. Um, so hopefully this worked for you. Guys, unfortunately, if it didn't work, there's only one step left and that's reinstall Windows. I hate to say it, that's the third and final step. But don't do that until the very, very end. If you can't figure anything out after that, if these don't work, go for the reinstall. But a lot of times, the CC Cleaner issue or the Verify, those are gonna work. Do the Verify first, as it's easier. Afterwards, try the CC Cleaner one, and you will be good. Guys, I hope this video helped you. If it did, do me a huge favor. Smack that like button. I really do appreciate all your time. 
Thank you guys so much. If any of these steps did work for you, let me know down below which one did so I can recommend more and let people know what's working the most. I know all of these have worked from people that I've told before, but I want to see what works the best. Thank you guys, and as always, smack out. <laughs>